There's my progress. This is the scrap yarn afghan. I've got let's see, one, two, three, four, five rows done so far. <laughs> it's really, really long. I like the colors. I've got to make a few more rows. So, you know, it's be wide enough for me. But it's looking good. Wanted to show you how many uh, strips I've got done and the colors. Oh, it's amazing. And it's long because I'm a tall guy. Look at them beautiful colors. Huh? I think that so far is looking really, really awesome. And I wanted to show it off to you, keep you up to date on how I'm doing. So, it's coming along. And the other afghan I'm working on that's uh, also long strips and done with the waffle stitch. I'll show you more on that in another video. I'm still working on that. Still trying to, between the two of them, I'm trying to plug it out. Trying to get them done so you can see how well it works. Now, I also wanted to tell you, when I put these uh, strips together, there's going to be um, a row on the ends of these all the way around in black or white before I hook them together. So it isn't going to look like this. It's going to have a, another row on the outside of here of black or white. i got to decide what I want to do, and then I will hitch them together. So it's going to look beautiful. So there you go. That's an update on my scrap yarn afghan. Uh, I think I'm going to do at least three or four more rows to make it wide enough, you know, and, and long, it's already long enough for me. Just want to make it wide enough. And then each uh, strip is going to have some extra rows of either white or black or maybe both. I don't know. I haven't decided yet. And then I'll put them together. And when I get to that point, I'll show you that point. Like, share, and subscribe. I hope you have an awesome Sunday. See you later.